What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mop, coming at y'all with another mukbang. Okay, y'all. How y'all doing out there today? Today, I am hungry, y'all. Uh, I don't know what time y'all gonna see this video, but whatever time you watch this, I hope you guys are having a, a blessed day, a wonderful day. Hope you guys have a great day today. Um, and, and I wish you all a uh, happy, what the day is? Monday. Happy Monday, everybody. Okay, y'all. So today, I have some pineapples i went to walmart and i got me some fruit y'all it's a little walmart fruit thing like this you know and it had um it got pineapples in it and grapes so i'm like oh i can do that i can eat that for a mukbang and i got me some cold ice <laughs> with no water i was gonna use my water bottle here but my it was making my picture look a little orange y'all and i didn't want to look like no oompa loompa girl so i had to put my water bottle to the side my water bottle blue and it looked like this if anybody interested it looks like this and it got all the times on it like what it start i think it started at eight o'clock on both sides it go from eight all the way to six o'clock like eight nine ten eleven twelve one two three four five six all of that to let me know how much you know so i keep track of my daily water intake and i have two of these so i drank two a day and that's it see how see how i'm looking orange you know i'm looking a little orange so let me get this out of the shot okay Did it, did it do anything? Did it tone down a little bit? Okay. Anyways, I felt like I was looking a little orange. So, I'm just going to put my, my water back on. I'm going to put my water in this glass. Or maybe I'm tripping, child. So, I'm going to put the water in this glass anyway because I'm going to be bougie. You know, so I'm having in my little bougie glass. I'm going to pour that in there without wasting it. Oh, <laughs> oh, she wasting stuff. Okay. Oh, that look up. That look up whole half of my water. Wait a minute. I ain't got to drink no more water if I drank all this to uh, by 11 o'clock trial. Okay. Um, in real time, it's really morning time around here. And um, I think it's around about, let me see what time it is. It's 8.16. So, Oh boy, it's morning. It's breakfast. So this is my breakfast today, y'all. Um, I didn't feel like eating too much of anything, but I said, let me go ahead and get me something to eat so I can make me a little video. So, oh, let me see my grapes. So we can eat, y'all. Almost, I almost dug in. Okay. Oh, come on, necklace. God is great. God is good. Lord, I thank you for my food. By my hand, you're my best friend. Thank you, Lord, my daily bread. Amen, Lord. Let this food be pure, clean, and nourishing for my body. Let it not cause no hurt, harm, or danger, Lord. Bless everybody as they go along their days, God. And let them have a happy Monday, God. Thank you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Okay, y'all. We are ready to dive in it. Okay. Um, I'm, I need to add some water because I feel a little parched. <laughs> I hate when my glass when I hold my head up like that. I hate it, girl. Mm. Yo, I'm these mukbang videos kind of they long, y'all. So I'ma try to do my videos without editing them. I'ma try to start recording my videos without editing them because if I got to edit my videos, honey. It's going to take me all day. That's what slows me down on this channel because it's so long. And I'm like, I edit my videos. So I'm just gonna um start trying to just go with flow in my videos and whatever I do that's what you're gonna see it is what it is and that's it and that's all okay so I'm just gonna roll with the punches and we just gonna let it do what it do okay so first I got some pineapples let me taste one of these pineapples wonder why this one's so yellow it better be some good okay yeah so I'm gonna try not to be doing all that extra editing because if I edit a 45 minute video it's gonna take me about an hour or two two hours no two hours or three hours to just edit the video like anybody got time for all that child please i see why miss b love say she don't edit her video because that don't take forever if i gotta cut out every time i say something crazy does that make my time be longer mm -mm. i'm just gonna come on here say what i gotta say get off i'm not editing nothing but that will help me with my videos um more often because i got like three videos that i already recorded that i gotta edit and i'm like man just the the whole point of me the whole just knowing the fact that me i gotta edit them 
it's like, oh, because I don't have that much time in my day that I got Nivea. And while she's here, I can't do all that. I can't sit on my computer for three hours straight without paying her no attention. She going to. Get on my last nerve, child. Child, no, I can't. It can't be done. <laughs> She'll be leaving the girl one day. Mm -hmm. Mm. I want you to go to Chili Cheese today. I got a fault because I thought I was going to be bougie, but then the ghetto came out my child, so that got a hand, okay? I thought I was going to need me a fault, but mm -hmm. whatever. I want to, I want to, if I, if I take my glasses off, then I won't be able to see when the camera stop. But I try for a little bit. I let y'all see me without my glasses for a little while. I know a lot of people say, oh, you look, you look so much better without your glasses. Listen, honey, I, I look better to you, but you don't look better to me. I'm just going to keep it 100. You don't look, I can't even see you. I can't even see the camera right now. I just know I'm in here. I see the slight shadows and stuff, child. I ain't got no 2020 at all, okay? Do, do pineapples got seeds, y'all? I just wonder if pineapples got seeds in them. Have you seen these little, um, these little brown things in the pineapple? Or is that the hood, child? I don't know. The hood, the, the, what, what you call it outside of pineapple? The hood? The shell? Whatever it's called. I just wonder if it's some seeds in there. It gotta grow from some, so it gotta have some seeds in there. Some kind of weight on it. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Where's my napkin? My cup won't let me be gray, it's dirty and stuff. I got fingerprints. So anyways, y'all. Guess what? There's another YouTuber by the name of RDR. R -D -R -D -R, that's his name. And I be watching his videos every now and then. You know, I don't have time to watch everybody's video on YouTube because, um... It's just something I just don't have, you know. I got a lot of things going on, child. So, but I do skip through a few videos every now and then. And there's this one mukbanger called RDR. He do food reviews. He's a mukbanger. I just said that, yeah. But anyway, y'all, he is, I listened to one of his videos yesterday. It was a live video. He was so, like the message he gave was like, it was helping me help, keep um lifting me up, y'all. I can't even talk. It lifted me up in a positive way. Cause I've been through so much. And sometimes it's get, it gets so stressful making these videos. Um, compare yourself to other people. Compare yourself to other YouTubers. And you want to be like this person because you see them succeeding. And you want to be like that person. Because you see them, you know, getting all the views and all the glory and all of that stuff. Just be who you are. And love who love you back. Okay, that's that's pretty much all you can do on YouTube. And then, and then he was saying like, being on YouTube is like when some people like have high views or high subscriber counts and be in the millions and in the hundred thousand, they just uh they just somebody that get lucky. Don't worry because you know it, it ain't your time yet or my time yet or whoever time yet. Um, it's because they're not there because. Some people stress over the pettiest thing, you know. And being up there in the top, it ain't for everybody. Sometimes being at the bottom and blessing a few folks that's watch that watches you is where God wants you to be, you know. And I'm like, man, after ten years, I be thinking it's it's almost been ten years, and I'm getting ready for my ten year anniversary with YouTube. Am I gonna have a ten year anniversary party? Hey, we might have to, I have to have a giveaway or something. Or, I don't know. I don't know why, how people treat that. Do people even celebrate those things? Um, I don't know, but... Uh, but anyway, but that just goes to show you that a message can come from anybody. It don't have to be from a speaker, a motivational speaker, a pastor, a celebrity, or anybody. It can come from anybody. As long as they speak in facts, you feel me? And you know when people speak in facts. But, anyway, y'all, let me get into something. Oh, yeah. Shout out to RDR. 
for the inspiration. And I'm just going to let my channel do what it do. Keep it moving. And the people who support me, I love y'all. For real. Y'all already know. And everybody who bought a bonnet today, I mean, yesterday and last night, is getting shipped today. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm always working. I try my best to be the best um, at what I do. Not the best, but the best me. Okay. I don't want nobody to be like, oh, she ain't the best. There's somebody better than her. No, nah, there's always somebody better than you. I mean, I want to be better than myself. Okay. Is that is that is that possible? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> mm. Y'all, this pine apple fruit thing was three dollars. Three dollars and ninety eight cent. Okay. And it's very good. Mm. And for y'all new people. <laughs> And those who don't know, I'm wondering why I eat fruit. And I try to, I try not to eat too much fried food and unhealthy food, y'all, because it's it's been a, it's been a struggle for me. No, not eating has been a struggle. Life has been a struggle, and I'm trying to do better. Okay, when you know better, you do better. That's all I gotta say. You know, I feel like um, sometimes as you get older, things change. <laughs> and your body start going down south, girl. Nobody, all the the body parts start flapping. But now I got like Batman wings and stuff. Chai. I probably won't never get rid of them. I don't know. Cause I ain't got enough strength in my arms, in my hands to lift the weight. So I don't know. I ain't, I ain't worried about all that for real. But I am. It, look, I just keep eating across my face. I'm not left-handed. Maybe I should have put the food on the right. Yeah, maybe that's what I do, Carl. Well, that don't make no sense. I can't. I got to see some y'all. Y'all see me? Okay, I can see y'all now. Let me, let me move this. Okay. If I saw somebody eating grapes with a fork, I think that would irritate my soul for real. Y'all, summertime is getting ready to come back. Praise God. It's, it's going to be summertime. I am so ready to just be able to sit outside and enjoy the weather. Just enjoy the weather because I've been in such a gloomy state and it's been like cold. I had to sit in the house. I'm tired of being in this house. Y'all know I got two babies in this house. I'm about to go doggone crazy. Just, all you do is sit, all I do is sit in the house and just hear crying and, and talking and, and Noah's, oh my God, I'm so ready to be at peace. Mm. Even though I love him so much, Mom. I love the kids. Mm. I can't even, I can't believe what I'm doing here. You ready to pop? Okay, I'm, I'm going to do it again. I can't, I can't show no proper etiquette. It ain't happening. I gotta drink my water for today, too. So, how many of y'all trying to get a summer beach body? Somebody asked me that I still wear waist trainers and what waist trainer I'm currently wearing. Um, and I don't, I don't really know. Um, the answer to that, because I don't wear waist trainers like that, but I, because I, it's winter time, I don't get no motivation until it get hot, y'all. I don't get no motivation to exercise nothing, because I be stuck in the house, even though I got, um, weight stuff in the back, and, it, what you call the thing? I got a few exercise machines, I got an exercise back, and I got a, a Zale, but physically, I've been like, I be in a lot of pain in my hips and stuff. Man, I'd be like, man, I don't need, I ain't man, forget working out. But at the same time, I need to work out. And that, that'll help me feel better with my hips. See, I go again with it out. But that'll help me feel better with my hips and stuff. But it's so hard to work out when you're in pain. You know? Um, I thought at one point that I was, I was doing better. And then all of a sudden, it was like, 
why am I hurting? Because my doctor told me that radiation was a gift that kept on giving. And I'm like, what you mean by that? So even after you're done with radiation at the, at the uh, doctor, for, you know, and all your stuff, the radiation is still working in your body months and months later even after you have it you still like radioactive and I'm, well you're not radioactive but the radiation is still doing its thing so well i'm not 100 percent sure if you're still radioactive for how long because i think they told me i wasn't radioactive anymore but for a little while at some some of the procedures you're radioactive and i don't even know what that means and i think i think that means if somebody else come in contact with you they can get radiation and i don't even know like what that means like can what, what happen if somebody else get near me what will happen i never asked that question they just told me to stay away from babies and from babies and pregnant people i don't know so i don't know if y'all been through what i've been through and y'all know what i'm trying to say holler at me because i don't know what i'm talking about mm. Mm. -mm. pineapple you wasn't sweet i'm gonna need you to do better i'm gonna need you to do all the way better because that wasn't sweet and it look better than me doing like this, y'all. Oh, girl. I ain't wrapped too tight all the time. Okay, I done got my, I done got me some two hours worth of water in. I done got me two hours worth of water in. The water tastes nice after eating the pineapple Jesus be a fence. Mm-mm. I cannot deal. Mm. Y'all, I got three other mukbangs that I had already previously recorded. And I'm thinking, I'm going to delete them. I think I'm going to delete them because I wasn't, like, I wasn't, I wasn't very entertaining. I'm probably not entertaining now. Oh, oh, y'all said y'all wanted me to talk about some topics. Somebody told me they wanted me to talk about my first time. And I didn't want to talk about that one. <laughs> Girl. It wasn't, it, it wasn't a, should I say, it wasn't a pleasant one, okay? I think that was Sean. Hey, Sean, how you doing, girl? So, yeah, I don't want to talk about that one. But, it's some other story time topics I'm going to have to look up. So, when I come on here, I'll be entertaining to you guys. I want to be exciting and fun like I'm up. Because, listen, this channel is a little bit more, I'm a little bit more, not scared, but more shy. Well, y'all know good and well I ain't shy, but I'm not as I, I'm not as open and outspoken on this channel because it's it's kind of different and weird. Cause you got to eat and talk at the same time the whole time you're doing it, so it's like I'm getting the hang of it. So, but I like to talk a lot, and I can't really talk a lot if I'm eating, you know. So I'm trying to get it well. I don't be talking and food all over my face and, and food going everywhere. I ain't, I ain't got time for all that now. I, I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to be decent, you know. I'm still I'm still be ratchet me, but the decent man ain't going to have food all over my face. The devil is a whole lie. Mm -mm. I feel like I'm getting so full from, is it the water? Mm. Back to the waist trainers. Okay, who's trying to be fine for 2019? Because summertime about to be here. And I don't know what I'm going to do with myself, but I'm going to have to wait till after my next doctor's visit, y'all. Because y'all already know how I be stressing and, and I'm already been thinking about it now. But uh, I, I'm okay for right now. Oh, my hand's been really hurting me in these last couple of days. And what makes it so bad is I'm running out of bunnets, y'all. <laughs> I'm running low on, on my bunnet stock. And my hands want to start hurting, you know. So, um, that prevents me from making bunnets, you know. So, but I'm, I'm trying my best. I'm, uh, um, I got to start, I got to start back making them because I don't want to get my, um, stash too low. I already got some, some things ready, but it's just that right now I'm in a weight, I'm playing a weight game, uh, with my hands. If y'all still watching this and you know, like, a good solution to help me with the pain in my hands, please help. Like, please help. Because 
I be telling my doctor, he just tell me to take pain medicine. He'll prescribe me pain medicine. And I don't, listen, how many ibuprofen 800 milligram do I need to take? Like, for real? It don't even do nothing for it. Is there, is there, is there a solution for the neuropathy? Um, it's in my hands, y'all, because it, it's about to drive me nuts. I'm tired of it now. I mean, enough is enough. Fatra got there or something. Yeah, man, enough is enough. I'm tired of all of that. All of it. I, I do good, but the thing is, to do it constantly, so y'all only see me in a few minutes in a video, but to constantly bend my fingers, I have these shooting pains, and it kind of goes, it kind of goes in between I feel like it goes in between, like it runs through my arm and just you can feel like it's like somebody running across my hand. That's what it feel like on both of them, like like I'm getting electrocuted or something every now and then. But then I kind of I've been I've been I've been dealing with it for so long that it's like I get used to it, but then I don't because it's like oh, and then you uh, listen. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but if anybody got those problems, help us sister out, please. Cause I'm kind of delayed in making my bonnets because I can't physically make them as 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 I want to. Um, my doctor just give me 800 milligram ibuprofen because, mm -hmm, and because I was taking gabapentin, and the gabapentin is like, I don't know. I be scared of some of these medicines, y'all. Even though I know I took chemo, I be scared of some of the other medicines. Like, man, chemo is enough. I don't want nothing else that's deadly or dangerous or could be potentially hazardous. I don't want it. Even though, even though after all the chemo and the radiation, I feel so much better. But at the time I was taking it, I felt, oh my God, unexplainable. But, y'all, let me not talk about it. Cause I get deep into it and I feel like I be feeling like people be wanting to say girl would you shut up talk about this that was a long time ago I be feeling like people think that that's what I feel like that's why I don't really talk about it like that but it feel like it never ever goes away I feel like I got to go back and forth to get checks to get check checkups about it for the next five years of my life and it's like that's a long time Oh, y'all, the struggle is real. But we ain't gonna talk about that, y'all. We're gonna be smiling and happy today, okay? Because this is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Oh, y'all, I'm ready to go to Bible study again. I just like to be in the presence of, in the presence of the people who love God. And, you know, even though God ain't through with me yet, y'all, I got, he got a lot of work to do with me. That's why I'm still here, because he got a lot of work. <laughs> he got a lot of work you got to do with me. On me. Let me go on down this water because this said I'd be done to 11 o'clock. So. See? <laughs> this why I got that big red big old water bottle. I feel like I just took 5,000 sips and that joke didn't barely move. <sighs> I'm going to do it again. Still there. Ooh, child. I'm about to bring some water drinking videos to y'all so y'all can see. So we can drink water together. We be greasing our scalps together. We be oiling our scalps together. So why not drink water together? Call it a sip and talk. Okay? My water won't be cold because I have a problem with drinking cold water fast. My room temperature water goes down great and I get the job done. But with this cup, I can enjoy colder water because it tells me like what time I'm on, and it don't give me like a whole lot of pressure to hurry up and drink, hurry up and drink. Because my big one, my God, I thought I was gonna drown. I was drinking so much water, girl. I was drinking so much water, I was gonna drown on the inside. Can you drown on the inside for drinking too much water? Is that possible? Like for real? Because I was like, I'm about to. Water, water, water. Mm-mm. 
Let me force myself to drink that much no more. I know they say, oh, you just gonna pee it out. Mm mm. Before I pee it out, I got to sit in there. And I don't like that part. Sit a whole gallon of water in my belly. Mm mm. And then I be running to the bathroom 50 11 times. 50 11 times in one hour. Mm mm. Boy, I feel so bougie drinking, eating these great food or fault. Let me put my thumb, my pinky up. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say these pineapples right here for later. Cause I can't, I can't. I think I got too much water in my system, y'all. Let me get rid of these. Let me throw this up right now. Uh -huh. Yes, y'all. I've had enough, y'all. Um, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I appreciate y'all for hanging out with me today. Thank you, everybody who ordered bonnets. I'm um, gonna get on my job right now, and they all gonna be shipped out today. If you're still here watching this video, comment grapes in the comment section, y'all. Y'all already know I like to participate with y'all, and y'all say those stuff. Listen, and all those videos I didn't comment on, all those comments I didn't comment, respond to last night, child, I'm gonna get on that today, too, okay? Because I love to talk to you guys. I love y'all. Y'all my faves. Whoever leave a comment, y'all the MVPs. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and that's all I gotta say, and I'm gonna holler at y'all later. Bye!